Hey everyone, Lensman Oz here, and welcome to another First Look game. This time it's a game by the name of Transport Incorporated. Um, I've had this game for a little while now, and it's just been a struggle for me to get around to bringing out a First Look for you guys. So, apologies to the devs who, who gave me a copy of it. Um, it's scheduled to release quarter two this year, so that, that's around now. Um, I, I'm not sure exactly when it's going to release, there still is no actual release date but with the things going on in the world at the moment now I don't blame uh, any any companies for being behind on uh, some of their you know normal work if that you know if you get the if you get the, the gist I'm getting that um, but it's developed by Digifox and published by games operators uh, or and uh, playway uh, SA so it's a strategy game. This version that I have is limited to, I think, a year of the game. Um, it, it's a little bit different, but it's still a um, an interesting, interesting transport manager type game. Um, we'll just get into it. I've, I've, I've literally played it for once. I had to get up part way through, and because it's a time limited thing, it, it um, kicked me out. So we're going to start. I don't know, select a starting region. Let's do New York. Let's see what it does. Alright, so this is an early alpha preview version. It's limited to one game year, as it says. You just started your own transport company. We're going to hit next. I'm going to hit pause. Um, cause it's only a year. You know, I don't want to burn through all the, all the stuff. So first let's talk about transport demands. Select any city to see its demand. So it's Plattsburgh. See the symbols that have appeared next to the other cities. So these things here. These symbols represent the amount of people that want to travel from that city to your selected city. More symbols means bigger travel demands. Each city has its own unique travel demands, so be sure to explore them all. Depots are used to store and repair vehicles. Select the city where you'd like to place your first depot. Now I reckon here. Because then we can get around a bit. So let's go here. Road vehicles we will need a road depot. With, a city, with the city selected, the road depot button will be available in the bottom right panel. Alright, cool. Down here. And it cost us 25,000 monies. Sure, we've only got 113,000, so I don't want to burn through all my money. Plan routes for your vehicles with route lines. These will guide your vehicles on how to transport passengers between cities. Okay, select the city where the route will begin. So we're going to begin it here. And we're going to click road route. Uh, okay, so it's got some peoples. Okay, let's go here. Um, you added a city to a route, but you don't have to stop there. Select more cities and add to the route if desired. Right, click the right mouse button to finish and create the route. Okay, so I'm going to click this city as well, and I'm going to right click. We've got a bus that will, or whatever transport that will go between these three. Buying a vehicle. So we go to the shop. We'll buy a bus that carries 24 people apparently. We can drag a vehicle onto a route. Okay, so I'll just grab it and drop it there. Cost us 23,000. Great work. See those two bars below the bus? The white bar represents the amount of passengers on the bus. I don't know if I can move the map around a little. Ah, I can. White bar represents the amount of passengers on the bus. The bar will keep changing, so keep an eye on it and make sure you are transporting enough passengers to make a profit. Can we close that window? Bottom bar represents condition of your bus. Your vehicle will break down once this bottom bar is fully depleted. Let's hit play. Oh, it's full. We've got 24 people on it. It's heading to wherever this place is, Burhampton or something. I'm not from the area, I don't know. And it's just made $1,128. It's full of people again. We're heading out to Albany. Well, that's how I would say it. Sorry, Sorry if I mispronounced. Okay, it's going to go here. It's going to empty all its people out. It's a road 
the road closure over here, that's pretty cool. Dynamic sort of events that happen. If we had a road closure, we'd be kind of stuck because you'd have to go all the way around through here and back. And so it's full, it's it's doing all right. He's going back to here. So then with the amount of people, right, when a vehicle stops in a city, an amount of money will appear showing you if you earned or lost money. These earnings or losses are based on the amount of passengers the vehicle transported. A lot, it looks like. $1,128. Lowering prices is a good way to attract more passengers. You can manipulate the ticket price on each route line. Well, I mean, goodness me. Lower your economy ticket price. I'll put down a dollar. I'd like to see more detailed information on something you have selected. You can open the information window. It's that one. Okay. So we, ooh, look at that bigger bus that these people have started with. Uh, we've transported 52 passengers. 72 now. And we've made a net profit of $9,000. Only got one vehicle. I reckon we drop another one on. What do you reckon? Uh, this can go faster, but it carries less people. This can go slightly faster, carries half again and the number of people. It's a little bit more expensive though. I want to I want to do this while I can. <laughs> Let's go. Um, company is growing fast, but you're not the only company around. Let's learn about competition now. In week number four. Other companies will try to steal your passengers. Lower your ticket price and provide faster vehicles with better comfort to fight back. Select a vehicle and use the information window to view its speed and comfort. Double click your vehicles to quickly open the information. So let's just double click on one of these guys. Uh, okay, so its speed is 85. It's doing well. Uh, it's fairly, fairly uncomfortable to be on. It doesn't have any uh, class, first class capability. All right. So should I, now that I'm starting to make some money, should I? Get a decent, a decent bus. Maybe I shouldn't have bought that better one. I don't have the monies to buy anything better. This is faster and carries less. Uses less fuel, it looks like. Costs more to maintain. Okay. Your actual balance is zero. <laughs> okay. I guess that's the amount coming in. For that week, maybe, or... It goes fairly quick I and mean, it's winter so should I, should I maybe do another route should we do that should we go buffalo yeah, let's do this go here and then here and make that another route let's get some buses uh, I reckon it's gonna cost all my monies no I'm gonna I'm gonna grab a couple of these maybe we'll get some people moving that one's almost, almost full. $900, not a heap of money. 382, that didn't have much at all. You can zoom in a little, look at that. Okay. $1,010, what have we got over here? 1986 that's decent nice amount of money coming in these two should make a good profit so you can see this is a um, as I said it's an alpha build it's a uh, it's designed to be released soon uh, I'm not as I said earlier I'm not sure when um, it is a strategy game it's done by an indie company um, and um, there's a lot of information here which we haven't even scratched the surface of. Look, we can change the driver's salaries. We can set up a... Ah. So, I apparently need to send these guys to get repaired myself. Okay, don't know how that works, but... We could rent an office for 30k and have someone else do it. Apparently we have a loan. I should probably be paying some of that back. Oh, I just, yeah, I just paid some money. Look at that. 
monthly payments at 6,404. We could probably just up that a little bit, right? Up that. Oh, yep, I can drop the money down a bit, and that should pay us off a little bit quicker. So it looks like there's uh, there's going to be trains. There's obviously some better buses. These people are. Oh look, there's competition. We can sabotage. We can spend five thousand and close the road on them. Oh, interesting. Interesting indeed. We've got capital city. Yep, it's got an airport. Uh, let's see here. We can do some. Looks like you can do a survey. You can survey the city and get ideas of what people want. Two, two first class people over here. These guys are coming to steal my people. I don't like that. I'm not happy. Get out of my town. Oh, they're on. What are you doing? A day. Practice. We're trans. It must be trans. Yeah, they've come and uh, jumped into my area. Drop the price a little bit. Can't afford another bus yet. Nothing decent anyway. Wouldn't mind upgrading a couple of our vehicles to this guy. Faster, more comfort. They're expensive. This guy is definitely cutting into our area. You drag a vehicle here. Okay. So I gotta grab him. Put him in here. Finish the route. You two can go there. Cool. Once you've done, you will repair yourself. Okay, so you have to upgrade your looks like you upgrade your, your depot. And uh upgrade capacity, upgrade the maintenance level or something. Ah. Costs us some more money per month. Ah, uh, look, he's got... An, oh, this is going to affect us too. We've got a, a road that's out. For many events that can change the demands of travel. Events will appear on the right side panel. Hover your mouse over the icons. Let me just do this. Um, close this. And we've got holidays. Slightly increasing existing demand during holiday months. This is not good. The guys cannot get through here. Got our two vehicles in here. Are you done? You're getting repaired. As soon as you're repaired, I'm assuming they may not automatically go out. We may need to do that ourselves. Let's see what happens. Let's only work on one vehicle at a time. Oh, off we go. Well, that's interesting. Uh, can I get rid of that, please? Yeah, I don't want to see that anymore. Where are my, my buses? How are you able to drive? Oh, you're doing this bit right. It's this one. Ends in one day. Road closure. Almost fixed. And... Oh, you can sell them. Go. Nice. Continue on your way, buses. All bright and shiny and repaired. I don't think I can stretch out to these other towns either. Um, debating whether to do a. I can't do a road between here. Got these covered. I mean, like, I could probably try and. I don't know. How are we going with money here? 1800. See, these guys are doing all right. But we've got higher class people here. Let's grab this guy and drop it onto this route. Cost me a lot of money. And he goes fast. Look at him go. And he should be able to carry more people in comfort. Wow. Off it goes. Let's see how he does. He gets there. 
empty, full 1840, so it's still about the same amount of money. Um, there's an earthquake going on down here. Yes. So those people are okay. New bus is cruising. Still getting the same amount of money. Where's my other bus? I didn't replace a bus. I should have. Did we lose a bus. Hey, where's my other guy? They like literally right on top of each other. Yes, they're right on top of each other. Guys, you're not going to make any money if you just drive next to each other. Imagine that you're standing at a bus stop. Bus turns up. Right behind it's the next bus, and then there's nothing for the rest of the day. Come on, people, get with the program. All right, so we're. He's not making a great deal of money. This is his, obviously his profit. I'm assuming. Unless it's lifetime profit. Let's see what it does in the next town. 1840. So, obviously, expensive vehicle. Whether or not it's helping me, I, I don't know. These guys aren't carrying as many. Should I drop one of these buses on here? Maybe if I could afford it. Uh, what do we got? Victory Girls is earned 10 million. Don't have that yet. Why are we still paying this off? Number of payments, six. We are winning in dollars. Or in value, I should say. Our net worth is higher. Loan limit's gone up, loan amount is at 42,000. Should be going down. Interest rate at 8%, yikes. Yikes, yikes. All right, so we got, eh, they're doing okay in profit. Do I set up another one up here just with like one, one thing on it? Let's go here to here and be done. Um, back and let's just get I kind of want to move one of these buses so let's send one of these guys in here yep we'll get him repaired up and then maybe we can drag him onto that other town onto this other line and he should come in here in a minute Buses both need repair. Uh, it might make another trip. Oh, look, they're separating now. I did one breakdown. Alright, let's see how we go. You should go in there. Yes, excellent. Repairing. The other one, you will need to be repaired soon. You can come here next. You are repairing. I don't want to like drag you out, put you on here. See if that's possible. Everyone repair up, costing me money, losing me stuff. These people are like trying to take over and take on my people. I got a broken deal. Yeah, I knew it would happen. We knew it was going to happen, right? See you a mile away. Just pushing it to its limit. That vehicle should eventually come down. I'm assuming it's going to come back. Okay. Eagle's broken down, so we're a bit of depot concern. Grab your drag. I've already done that. Um, my computer's trying to windows over top of stuff. Uh, where is that vehicle? You, you, here. Come on. Okay, so he's going to come over here for uh, for some repair. Let's see what he does when he gets there. Obviously, it'll be just like everything else. That other vehicle we were able to. Um, Put onto that line. He's making a bit of money too. Two, three. There might be some some worth here. Might be worth us dropping another vehicle up here. We can probably afford to buy another basic bus, maybe. A little bit more comfort holds less people. Let's do that. There we go. It's like two grand more. Less people. It's faster. A lot faster. So yeah, we go. Oh, you're repairing, finally. As it comes along, somewhere. 
bus is in. Full of people. It's emptying out. Sweet. Let's see what it makes. 1586. Cool. So we're doing alright with profit. We are no longer number one. We are at 148,000. Uh, trams and up transit are uh, doing better than us. Not ideal. You need to repair. I think you'll be okay. I think you should go next. Either that or I re replace the buses with something better. With a short. So I wonder whether we just grab this guy, drop him on that route. These guys will come in soon. Or oh, he's being repaired now, is he? So let's sell him. He's gone. Now that puts me below the money I need. Um, we'll repair this other one, but this vehicle should keep going. A little bit more refined than these guys. Okay, cool. So we've got... Uh, what are these? Can I buy one of these? Can we put these on the same route? What are you doing? Some sort of cargo vehicle. What are you doing? Capacity 20. I'm not carrying people. I'm carrying some sort of mail or some sort of cargo. Um, go. Does 110k an hour. Doing alright. Month seven. We're cruising along. We are not gonna win. How are you doing? What did you make? Any money? Don't know if that's your money. What are you doing? Chilling. No mail, no. Okay. But that's not a good run. Yes, there was no mail so I probably should have made a new route of um, here to here and be done with it and that mail guy will change his route we got Birmingham to Waterton I want you my friend You. Uh, you need to go on to. How do I get it on that other route? Well, that's a little difficult. I don't want to go to that one. I'm going to go between these two. Birmingham to this one. Ooh. Ah, I can drop it there. Ooh, okay, so we can select the actual run down here. And in the case of this one, there's two runs, so we can just select the one we want. Okay, I get it. I'm getting it. What do you like for the means? It's passengers. The, the cargo seems to be here. The, that should be a better run for those guys. I don't know whether it's going to make much profit. We'll see what it does. All right, well, it's month eight. We're getting along a bit in this uh, playthrough. There is winter semester coming up. All right, so that's giving you a bit of a, a look into the alpha version of the game. Um, links will be in the description below, as always. Um, thanks, everyone, for watching. Hope you enjoyed the game. Transport Incorporated, or Transport Inc., uh, done by Digifox and published by Games Operators and Playway. Um, take a look out for it. Check out the page on Steam. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye now.